So I'm here with Montague's Bryce Stark and Drew Collins. We got the veteran here with Bryce and the, the youngster here with Drew. Um, tell me a little bit, first of all, you Bryce, what that's like getting a win like this in your last time against Whitehall. Um, this was, I mean, it's huge. Uh, we have a big, big season going for us, and um, one of the biggest things was, you know, just no matter how good or bad a team is, this this game means so much to the White Lake community. I mean, it's for a bridge, it's for the bell, and uh, Joe Marsh, one of my the captains, my freshman year, he was on the junior team or the year before they were two and seven, and he said the worst feeling is watching that team leave with the bell. And I mean, that was what was in the back of our mind all day was that worst feeling is for them to come to our sidelines and take that bell from us. For you, Drew, what was it like in your first real experience in a game like this? Um, it was it was nerve wracking at first. Um, we have a lot of young guys on the team coming out here. I was grabbing my pants, I'll well, admit. <laughs> But we got into the groove in the second half, and it's always great to ring the bell for the first time. That's the quarter of the night, by the way. So, <laughs> but um, tell me about how you guys are coming together as a team too, because you had the rough one at Reed City where things just didn't go your way. You had the lead actually into the fourth quarter, but then kind of fell apart. But then you had some injuries, and then but now it looks like you're starting to round into form. Is that what's going on? Yeah. Um, a lot of the time in film after Reed City, Coach Cater was just stressing and stressing like, "Hey, we're not a team yet. We're not loose. We're just." We're all puckered up and just not playing like a team. We're just, you know, all kind of like, I'm worried about myself too much. And we had no energy on the field at Reed City. You know, if there was a big hit, no one really did anything about it. And uh, kind of like Shelby week, kind of okay. Mason County turned around and then North Muskegon and then now here. And it was just a big buildup and just the team's clicking. 